field, we've been doing research to examine the role that technology and platforms can play in expanding the reach and impact of mission-driven business lenders. And when I speak with micro and small business lenders about whether to use platforms or about their experiences in using them, I find that most of them are actually thinking about them in the wrong way. And that's because when they're thinking about platforms, they're focusing on the technology. But platforms aren't about technology. They're really about mission, business strategy, and business processes. Um, the focus on technology is understandable because it's advances in technology that make platforms possible and that make them more powerful. And more importantly, we read and hear every day about how FinTech is transforming business lending. And we're asking ourselves, and our funders are asking us, how we're going to use technology to improve and to stay relevant. And it's really important to answer that question. But in doing so, it's vital to remember that choices about platforms and technology need to be rooted in your mission, how your business strategy accomplishes that mission, and how elements of your strategy deliver value to your customers. So what does this mean for mission-based small business lenders? As lenders, you engage in a set of processes in the lending value chain, which start with the process of acquiring customers and ends with the servicing and collections plot process. Platforms can help to make those processes more efficient, but to achieve value through a platform, you need to be willing to use the tasks and the processes that the platform uses. So it's usually when we get to this point in the conversation where many CDFIs will say, well, it's because we do things differently that we add value to our customers. So we can't adopt someone else's processes. And I think this is where the field really needs to dig deep. It's not just a question of whether your existing process adds value to the customer. It's actually about whether your existing process adds much more value to the customer than an alternative process. So here's a quick example. There are a million different ways to organize a loan application form to get all the information you need. Many of those ways are bad and confusing, but there are also many ways to do it well. None of those good ways add more value than a different but still good way of organizing the form. So as you think about whether and when to standardize, consider this. The things that are the hardest to standardize, or maybe shouldn't be standardized at all, are those processes that are both unique and that add much more value to your customers than the alternatives. With everything else, you should be thinking about how technology and platforms can help you become more efficient because that's going to help you achieve your mission. Getting to this question of where you are unique and adding value means getting back in part to these questions of mission and strategy. So for example, is your strategy to try to compete with or offer an alternative to high-cost short-term business lenders, or to serve large numbers of business owners who have been declined by banks? Or is your strategy to dig deep to serve a particular target demographic or geography? If it's the former, you may be interested in a platform that seeks to automate and improve the referral connections between banks and CDFIs. But if it's the latter, bank referrals may not be your best customer acquisition strategy. And so going onto that type of platform may not be useful or most efficient for you. Or in another example, think about underwriting. Where do you add value in the underwriting process? Is it in the process of collecting information? Is it in the types of information that you look at? Or is it in how you structure and analyze deals so they fit the needs of borrowers? Some platforms and technologies will help you to collect information more quickly. Others will actually support or do the analysis and decisioning process. I'd argue that for many CDFIs, a lot of value is added in the process of analyzing and structuring loans, but you need to decide where your unique value lies. The one piece of advice we'd give you as you sort through that issue is that it's probably the case that there are relatively few aspects of your lending process that are both unique and value added to your customers. And using a platform can help you to create efficiencies that enable you to serve more customers or to do more of what's really adding value to your existing customers such as providing business advice. But remember, where you choose to end up gets back to mission and strategy. There are two other quick lessons from our work. The first is that using a new platform or implementing a new technology will involve driving change with your organization. People on your teams will have to work and behave in new ways. Their jobs may change. You may need to create new roles and to eliminate others. 
In the end, the value that you derive from a platform or technology will depend not only on choosing the right one, but in successfully managing the change process within your organization. Second, for organizations that want to use a platform to scale their lending activities, remember that if you use a technology or platform to address one key bottleneck or issue in your lending process, it can create spillover effects. So for example, if you're able to use a platform to open up a pipeline of new referrals and you originate lots of new loans, it can create an issue if your risk management, servicing, and collections processes are not sufficiently built out. So as you consider technologies and platforms, you may find it useful to think ahead and consider how you will address these spillover issues as well. As that question might inform your choice of which platforms or technologies to embrace and when. We very much believe that mission-based small business lenders can use technology to enhance their impact and scale but it will be important to approach the selection of technology with mission and strategy in mind.